Uh, Larry, Void, and Syro and Xan are all oh, that's make big moves. Right. While Nico, Charlie, and Eon are having a vacation in Japan, which right. they deserve. And again, it's going to be interesting to see the, the Snake versus Luigi matchup. Just because, you know, Luigi likes to go for a lot of grabs that has a lot of, like, combos. But if they're not frame perfect, then there's just a grenade coming out. Yeah, and as you mentioned earlier, Havoc is very much a Wi-Fi warrior. I'm looking at his place, he did take first place at JW42 way back in December. Right. Getting first place at the Wi-Fi tourney, which is pretty big. High Desert Smash is one of his local attendants as of last year, way back in September, getting first at that tournament here. So Havoc does have a bit of a name of being a Wi-Fi warrior, but when he shows when he's shown up a couple times here to, to locals in the flesh, yeah. he's able to put out some big numbers. Oh yeah. But I mean, what's the elegant who's been putting out big numbers way before oh. the kid has even set the scene? No. And you know what? Man, just to get the revenge <laughs> kill immediately. Elegant looks away. He said, you know what? I can't believe I let him do that. Yeah. Cause like, I, I just, got stuck right in my face with the big nose. I became Rudolph for like five seconds until I got back thrown and killed. Yeah. Oh, no. Nice. He, know, he knows that the fact that, you know what, going for a missile is going to beat out the 7% threshold of armor that Sneak does get with the Cypher. All right. And you know, I like what he's doing because he knows that, hey, if you're going to go down there, I'm just going to get that free damage, you know? Yeah. And if you don't take it, you're dead. Looking for a possible down air, oh. and he waited for it for a good opportunity. He knows, you know what, Havoc, you're going for those low recoveries, but the one thing that you need to understand, the one thing we do, we do see from Snake usually tend to opt for is those high recoveries for a good right. reason. And that low recovery shows a good reason why you don't want to pick it as a recovery option. It's usually going to be high or mid, mixing up your Cypher and directional air dodge, and even C4 and grenade stalling when you're way up above. Right. And you know, Elegant having the stock lead meant that he could afford to go down super deep for the suicide kill. Yeah, and still, if he whiffed it, then like, you know what? I still have another stock to deal with. Exactly. And he's at, yeah, like, most definitely. Yeah. Good parry oh. coming up from Havoc, but unfortunately Elegant will take the capitalization here. Big damage, 51 to 54, taking this man all the way to 74 off of a grab. Yep. Elegant is not going to hold back here. Not going to be the fire finish here, but such a big lead for Elegant and Havoc to figure out how to come back. I mean, we talk about edge guards, but no, that Nikita is an edge guard and a half in and of itself. So Elegant has to be super careful how he recovers too. And that was a little bit cheeky on Havoc's heart to try to go for the jab to grab, but you know, Elegant not falling for it. Oh nice. my god. Good use yeah. of the empty hop here. Yeah. It was good because at that opportunity, one the one thing Havoc would have been expecting is a grab, but that's what Elegant really wanted. His opponent to be fearful of the grab option to let go of being gra a shield to avoid getting grabbed. No, he just came back and he's already at 100% almost. Yeah. Almost. Dare I say, almost he is over 100% at this point. Havoc just does not seem to have the Luigi experience in order to deal with Elegant. Yeah, Elegant is a top seed here alongside Razo. T3 Dom, and of course, either Zenyu or Master Mario. And seeing how Master Mario got upset by Glug, and Zenyu still continues to move on towards winner's side of bracket. One of these four players will find themselves the winner of SoCal Chronicles. Right. Yet again, the up smash covering both options if he crossed or didn't cross up. Yeah. Elegant waits for it. He knows when his invincibility runs up, gets the grab here, puts Havoc at such a tough position, almost gets the fire finish here from the up special. You know, the up tilt, finally taking a, a stock, you know, at least, you know, better late than never. But, you know, Havoc is going to have to make some really big plays if he wants to, you know, bring it back to it, even stocks. Yeah. I mean, he's got 85%. He's still got Elegant on the freshest of stocks here. But finally picks to go for a higher recovery, looking to cover something up with a C4, but unfortunately missed the mark. And I like it, too. Even if he wasn't going to get Elegant, getting rid of C4 when it was, wasn't usable towards center stage makes sense for Havoc. I like that, using the dare to cover the normal getup, but you know he still needs to find this kill. Nice. Gets the up smash. Gets the cover up here, Elegant on 70%. This is a percent where Snake can definitely capitalize if Luigi is off stage. 133 dash attack to put him off the stage. Nikita in play. Havoc is making sure he's tossing everything out for just this one stock because he knows what it means. Right. Ooh, I like while you try to use the dare to cover the air dodge in, but you know what? Elegant just landing in with there and kind of catches him off guard. Now he's off stage. Oh, nice. I, I understand why he wanted to go out there. He wanted yeah. to either go out there with Dare or Fair. Right. 
Directional air dodge. Talk about how some snakes like to use that to get the extra boost. Yeah. And what the extra, what the air, directional air dodge does too is that it releases the cipher early enough so that you can use it as like a way to cover the ledge. Yeah, and the hitbox too, especially if your opponent has it covered. Goes for the mash, down throw, not enough just yet, but Elegant meets him up in the skies for a reason to either get a cyclone right. or an upper like so. And, and it just got hit. sent right into the corner, just avoiding all that. And now, yet again. 163, this is super high percent for Elegant, but you gotta imagine that this is only his second stock. <laughs> Uptail. I like it because he knows the one, two options have it going to add at the ledge here. That's